Hey everyone! So I thought it would be time to show you some videos again on this blog that I'm doing. So I did a, quite a bit of shopping over the past couple of weeks and I just thought it would be a good idea to show you the things I got uh, in a video rather than with pictures because there's too much to put into one post if I were to make pictures and that's why I thought to show you this. Um, it's mostly clothing. I only got two things of makeup related items and I've got some accessories as well and some shoes and some bags so there's quite a bit to show you. Let's get started. Um, I'll start with makeup first because it's the smallest amount. Um, so uh, Max Factor came out with some new lipsticks. Uh, I can't even remember the name of these things um, but they're new and uh, so I got one because I really liked it. The packaging is really cool as you can see um, and uh, this is in the shade Mulberry. I hope my camera picks up on this. Um, and it's this really nice berry shade. Um, I can see I, I, I already nicked the tip of it, but it's really, really pretty. So I got that. And then I got one more makeup item, and it comes with a with a brush and with a, an eye pencil, eye coal. Um, and it's got two blushes in six different shades of eyeshadow, which, ooh, excuse me, are really, really pretty. And I will, uh, let's swatch this dark blue. And as you can see, it comes up really, really nicely. So then let's move on to clothes and bear with me because this is quite a bit. And, uh, you do have to know that. I tend I didn't I didn't get this all in one go yeah so I did go like shopping like three or four times uh, first up just plain opaque black leggings really boring but I didn't have one yet so I decided to get one and uh, next I got a couple of t-shirts uh, these this one comes from New York and, and it's just really a long sort of brownish red shirt and um, yeah, it looked really nice on, and it was on sale, so it was good. Um, then I got this sort of blush pink colored shirt with these uh, stars uh, on it. I don't know if you can see it, but it's got like little stars all over. So yeah, so that's this shirt, which I really, really liked. And then I also got, also from New Yorker, this also sort of reddish brown shirt, but it's like cropped in the front and it's got like the longer bit in the back, which is also really nice. And uh, like I said, I also went to Primark and I didn't get too many clothes from Primark because I don't really like their clothes that much, but I did get two shirts. Um, just again, some like rosy pink shirts, just really basic, um, basic shirts to put underneath other things and I've got and I got this one which I like better actually but the other one so I got my very first maxi skirt and I put this on a hanger so it wouldn't be so big and bulky but it's got this really pretty like small flower print on it and when I first put it on I was very skeptical because it made me look like a farmer girl first but then I put on some of my tops that I already have and some funky belts and I can actually make this work. So I got this dress, which is also a maxi dress, and I thought I would drown in this. I'm not very tall, and it actually works. I mean, I put this on, and yes, I do have to knot the end to make it work, but knotted, it actually looks better than when I just wear it full length. Another thing I got at H&M, and I, I saw this in a store a couple of weeks ago, and um, I tweeted about it, saying like, oh, I saw this thing and it, it looked really nice on. And I was very skeptical because I'm not really into the whole faux fur thing. But this looked so good on and it's so warm. I was like, you know what? It's not that expensive. It's H&M. So I was like, I, I just, I'm just going to try to make it work and see what I can do with it. And it's really warm. So for winter, this is going to be great. I also put in an order with ASOS.com. And they have the most gorgeous clothes, and I'd never ordered from there, and now I just decided to just do it. So I got a couple of blouses and a dress from there. And if you follow my blog, then you may have seen the pictures of this on the model. So 
So this is a really nice um, sort of half button down shirt with like the crochet detailing and a Peter Pan collar. The only thing I didn't know was that it's sheer. So yeah, I'm gonna have to wear something underneath it, but it does look amazing. So another thing I got was another sheer button down, which is this one, which is like a creamy yellow color. <clears throat> and again, this looks amazing on. I could just throw this on over a black t-shirt or anything like that and it works really well. And this blush pink shirt is very similar to the cream shirt and it's a really, this color looks amazing on. And I'm planning to wear this with either, you know, skinny jeans, black skinny jeans or leggings or anything like that. This dress, which unfortunately when I put it on the first time was way too big. It really was, but it's got these ribbons at the end, like it's got a tie. So I just tied it closer together. And then I did some sewing in the back to singe it as well. And now it fits perfectly. So, um, and this is just a really basic sweater dress, knitted, dark gray, short sleeved. It's really, really basic, but it looked really, really good on. So I had to have this. Final piece that I want to show you that I got sort of like my P.S. the Razy Stans, uh, my French isn't all that good, but um, I have been eyeballing uh, parkas or anoraks, whatever you want to call them, uh, online for a while and uh, for winter because I wanted to get a parka for winter. I have one for summer and I love that thing to death, so I really wanted to get one for winter, but I... The shade of green is a little too light for me, I think, but with like a darker scarf, again, it works, but it's got this as its lining. The main lining is this really, really soft and nice teddy bear-like material that's in this inside. It does have a faux fur color, which I'm not a fan of, but I can take this off because it's got buttons, and um, so I can just take that off and it becomes a completely different jacket. And so it's really, really warm because of that lining. That's it for clothes. Uh, that's all I got clothing-wise. So now it's on to accessories and I got a bunch of accessories uh, what I like most about Primark is their accessories bags shoes whatever I didn't get any bags or shoes from there this time around but I did got get some uh, other things so uh, first of all I got these hoop earrings but they're like dangling ones so you've got these sort of bronzy other pairs of earrings are the ones I'm wearing so these also came from Primark. They also have them. So these are the rings that I got. So this is a double one. So you put both of your fingers through it. And it's just a black sort of stone that's in there. And then on my other hand, I put this, it's this great emerald green, really bulky. I like how it's square and not round. I think that gives it a bit more edge. And then I got this key. I love keys. I have keys on necklaces, I've got earrings with keys, and now I've got a ring with a key. A set of earrings, which are actually just stud earrings, and they are super duper old fashioned and grandma-like, but I just thought these were really nice. Um, actually, an old fashioned telephone, which I thought was really this one, that I just had to have it. So it's just like a retro style boombox type of hanger with two music notes. Oops. Um, then I bought two bags. Actually, one of these bags I didn't buy because a couple of days ago I went shopping with my mom. This is mom. Um, and she saw this bag. And um, she was like, hey, don't you like that as well? Um, just pick a color. And this is the one. Um, I got it in camel. This is camel. I think this color was called camel. My mom got it in dark brown. So now we both have the same bag. But what we really liked about this is the detailing of this because as you can tell it's got zippers it's like all these different zippers woven together together with my uh, H&M order I also got this big green bag it's huge it it is amazingly big and it doesn't have a lot of pockets which is a downside if a bag is this big but look at that space I mean, come on, like this is, I can carry my entire life in this thing. And just everything can go in this and I can take it with me to work. And I love the color. 
Um, I found these, which are plain black, you know, just plain black, high boots. Sort of like a, a horse, you know, what you would wear if you go horse riding. That kind of thing. And I think, yeah, that this pretty much sums it up. That's all I got. Which, uh, as I told you, it's quite a bit. But I wanted to show you what I got over the past couple of weeks. And so, yeah, that that's all I got. This was my collective shopping haul of all of the shopping I've done in, in the past couple of weeks. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And check my blog if you want to. Um, there's tons more on there, too. So uh, definitely check that out. Thank you for watching.